Hey everybody, I am doing this vlog in the mirror because every time I hold my flip cam out, I cut my head off or it's just not, not cool. Apparently, back up a little so you don't have to stare at my face. Um, just wanted to do a quick cycle update for everybody. I'm on cycle day 15 today and I know I had posted that video where I talked about, um, just making sure I'm keeping my head in the frame. I posted that video where I talked about my OPKs. I showed you guys my OPKs. I took a digital one and it was negative. Boo. But um, I took another one this morning and it was also negative. And I took uh, just a regular um, internet cheapie, which was also negative. But when I put my temperature into Fertility Friend this morning, it gave me crosshairs. Um, saying that I am 3DPO and ovulated on cycle day 12. So... Um, here's a picture of that. I don't think that I believe it because, um, as you can see, there was not a lot of farming going on. Um, but the problem with that is that I did not test um, with OPKs the two days before that. So I could have gotten a positive OPK and um, I just didn't test. So I could um, have ovulated on the 12th, but I don't know. So I guess I'll just have to wait and see what my temperatures do for the next couple of days and see if they stay up over my cover line. I don't know, we'll see. Um, also wanted to show you guys a prize, another prize that I got for the contest, just to add to the prize pack. I was at Target today. If you guys can see this, there's like a glare. Um, it is just a little notepad that has a magnet on the back, so you can stick on your fridge or anything magnetic. And, um, I thought it was super cute. I had one of these on my fridge, but I ran out of paper, so I bought myself one, and I bought an extra one, because it was only a dollar at Target. Go Target! Um, so I thought I'd throw that in there. I write my grocery lists on it. When I'm in the kitchen, it's easy for me to look at things in the cabinets, figure out what I'm out of, and just write it on something that's on the fridge. So, I got that. Hi, baby. Hi. This is the second time I've done this vlog, and the first time I was sitting on the couch and tried to do it <clears throat> and ended up with really horrible lighting. My head was cut off, so that's why I'm doing it a second time. But she came and jumped on my lap and got on the camera. So she wants to be on YouTube. And then my other cat is up there looking at us, being a stalker and a creeper. Let me zoom in. Hey, well, what's up? What's up, dude? We have this like fake fireplace where it's a gas fireplace. It's just one of the ones where you flick a switch and it turns on. So we don't really have like a chimney. We just have this like tall thing. Hi, Vivi. Mo. Hi. I love you. You're on YouTube. Anyway, sorry if you're not a cat person. You probably don't care. But, um... Yeah, so we just have this weird, like, fake chimney thing, and it has this flat surface at the top, and our cats go up there all the time and scare the crap out of me because it always looks like they're going to jump. So, anyway, um, back to what I was going to tell you. My husband picked out a present for the husband if whoever wins the contest is someone that did a vlog with their hubby. What he shows is a book, and it's called The Alphabet of Manliness. So go check that out, and um, I guess I'll put a link down below to like the Amazon description, or if it has a website or something, I'll put that in there. But um, yeah, my husband's a dork and thinks it's hilarious. So uh, like he didn't even have to think about it. I was like, if the guy wins, you get to pick the present for the guy. You know, if, if the couple, someone that was a couple that did a vlog together wins, you can pick the thing for the guy. And he was like, oh, alphabet of manliness. So my husband's a dork. But I love him. So um, that's the prize for the dude if um, one of you ladies that's gotten your hubby to vlog with you is the lucky winner. So that's it. That's all I wanted to say. Um, what's everyone doing for Valentine's Day? Um, Kelsey, I know what you're doing. <laughs> um, what's everybody doing? I don't really 
really know what I'm doing yet. Um, Mike said that he was going to try to figure something out and tell me later, I guess. Surprise me? I don't know. Originally, we had planned on going to the firehouse, which is where we got married. Um, it's a restaurant, a really, really nice restaurant. Um, but he called to try to make a reservation, and it's 115 per person, and you don't get a choice about what you eat. It's just a set. Oh, my cats are crazy. It's just a set menu, and you just, like, you have whatever they give you, and it's $115 per person. So we're not going to do that. But, um, honestly, I'd be happy with anything. Um, we're probably just going to go out for dinner someplace and then go to a movie or something like that. Um, but, so, yeah, if you have really good plans for Valentine's Day, go ahead and leave me a comment. Let me know what you're doing. And that's it. Um, I'm done blabbing at you guys. So, I will see you guys soon. Oh, also, one thing that I just wanted to add. Um, I've been getting some friend requests on Facebook, but I don't know who they are, so I don't know if, um, if anyone that's watching this has tried to friend request me and I have not accepted it, go ahead and please send me a message and tell me who you are, because I know some people's Facebook is either their real name or, um, you know, it'll just say like TTC or something like that and it doesn't have your Facebook name, I mean your YouTube name. So if you've tried to add me on uh, Facebook and I have not accepted your friend request, it's because I don't know who you are. And originally I had had a bunch of people that I had no idea who they were. And so I just deleted a bunch of people. Um, also, if you're someone that I deleted um, and you, and I know who you are and you know me, then just send me a message and tell me who you are. Um, I just want to make sure that the people that I'm friends with on Facebook are people that I know and not random creepos. So, okay, now I'm officially done blabbing at you, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Mwah. Bye.